this their first playoff game? Knowing what's on the line, they need a regulation win. Overtime doesn't do it. And that's because they're three points back of tying Boston and Minnesota. And that would allow them to bump Minnesota because they have the tie break right now. Back to the hockey in Toronto, moving the puck. Sarah Nurse coming in strong, pulling in close through the middle. That's taken away by Savannah Harmon. Harmon's been so clutch for Ottawa, especially in the last five games. Turnbull working with Spooner and Miller tonight for Toronto. Jenner with a quick touch, now a chance. Natalie Spooner shoots. That one stopped Miller with a backhand. Another, they score! Toronto quick to it. And make that another goal for Natalie Spooner, her 19th of the season. And Danielle, we said it earlier, Natalie Spooner is going to make Ottawa pay on these mistakes. And Ashen Bell tries to get that rim out, but that puck ends up being dropped. Miller just missing that. And the puck goes right back out front, and Spooner is on the doorstep. But again, Ottawa looking to get the win tonight, but Toronto on the board early. That is Natalie Spooner's third opening goal. Sixth assist of the season. Miller scoring Toronto's only game-winning goal against Ottawa. Back on March 2nd, now a chance for the visitors. Skamora in front, they score! Gabby Hughes gets one by Kristen Gamble. Capitalizing on that timeout. To tie it all up, Gabby Hughes all smiles. And getting that equalizer definitely has to feel good for Gabby Hughes. But I love this play from Haley Skumara. She recognizes that she's the only one up here. She gets that pass just in behind. The Toronto defenseman lets up a little bit and puts that puck far pad for, for Gabby Hughes to come in and tap in by, right by Campbell. Not surprising. Both teams on the board in the first period. These two have played each other close. Taking the draw. Ottawa, or Toronto rather, gains possession, feeds it deep into the Ottawa zone. Victoria Bach chasing down Ashton Bell. Battle in the corner. And around, looking for some space, getting a shot in. Flanagan keeps it from the point, rims around fast, collects it. Daryl Watts with the physicality. Comes fast off, but another chance for Toronto. Rebecca Leslie now trying to shake off two Ottawa players. Bell in control, feeds it back. Shimrazova. And Puck still being worked from the goal line. Bach, she's got support, fast. Looking for a lane in front in the glove of Miser. Now coming out of the second one. Toronto. In the offensive zone, looking for some space. Sarah Nurse. Working around, cutting in front, she scores! Sarah Nurse celebrating. Bar down. Waiting for the officials to give the final word as well, but Ottawa looking on and looking again at a one goal deficit. And what a beautiful goal for Sarah Nurse here. We see Toronto win the draw, get that possession off the draw. Brittany Howard trying to get open for Sarah Nurse. She recognizes she's not open. She decides to turn back, cut towards the net, beat Snodgrass, and puts that one upstairs on Emirates Mashmeyer. There is the official. Keep that puck in zone as we know Toronto has been strong on their breakouts. Chance for Ottawa. Toronto hogging the puck. Bringing it out for Victoria Bach and Ashton Bell now. Sends it back. Lorian Rougeau with a quick touch of Kane Shiga get on her second goal of the season against New York on Tuesday. Rougeau certainly making her presence known in this game. Connors chases it down. Shiga off the wall, keeps the puck. 
Ottawa looks to pass it up. Well, she'll dump it as Ottawa goes for a change. Jenner trying to catch up with fast. Mrazov is there. And Harmon as well. Trying to clear it out. Bach looking for a centering feed. Watts in the way. And a good pass over to Brienne Jenner. She's got all kinds of room. Looking for some space. Watts in close. The dying goal. And you knew this was the line who needed to get it done. And a great heads up play for Daryl Watts here. She recognizes that Jenner has blown the zone here. The Rock is the only one back, but Jenner eases up, drops that puck to Daryl Watts, and then Daryl Watts just outweights Campbell and puts that one in on that right side. Beautiful goal for Daryl Watts to tie this one up. Coach Carla McLeod said that Jenner provides the leadership, Daryl Watts provides the energy, and Russ is Nurse Spooner. And Nurse gets it back. Power play unit, well tested here in the first season. Malte, back to the line fast, looking for some room. We were crossing in front is a scramble in front of the net. Spooner on it. We're getting a no goal. We're getting a no goal signal. The crowd, though, re block shots, good shots going to the net. Emily Clark trying to cut through. Ashton Bell. Down low, Hughes. He's got the board in the slot, kept in by Bell. Back to Hughes, one timer off the pad. Malte keeps it away. Not quite clear. Harmon returns. Clark, one on one with Monroe. Skamora with a stick on it. Rose to Harmon. She takes the shot. And Toronto comes away with it short handed. Malte and Turnbull. Two on one. A solid block by Ashton Bell. Times that perfectly, but still an Ottawa power play. And we're in their zone. And that's a great read for Ashton Bell. Obviously, shouldn't be caught on a two on one on a power play, but at the same time, Makes, their, makes Toronto make a decision on that one and ends up laying out and blocking that shot. A good penalty kill by the best penalty killing unit in the league. Only two shots on goal for Ottawa. Toronto, relentless. I mean, they're number one in the league for a reason. They haven't been overly successful against Ottawa. Ottawa's had strong third periods, but now looking to defend. Don't want to have to chase another equalizer. If Toronto gets the goal, Cheyenne Dark with six power play goals, more than some teams in this league. Fast from the point. Ottawa looking to stay alive here. Malte down low. Over to Miller. Miller with some room. Fine Spooner. She comes in close. Looks for the angle there. Her effort stopped short. Back to a nurse. And in front, Spooner. She scores. goals for number 24 Natalie Spooner her second of the night and that one's got a feel not too great for Ottawa here going down in the last five minutes here and unfortunately Sarah Nurse is standing here right on the doorstep and I, I'd like to see Ottawa be a little more aggressive on this PK we see Sarah Nurse get loose doesn't necessarily have anybody come out and attack her give them that stick but at the same time, a great job for Spooner again on the doorstep. Just ready there to put pucks in the net. We need this goal to tie things up. Miller. And it's a wily cross ice feed. It's Jim C. Rose and Natalie Spooner. What do you do? No penalty. And Ottawa with a chance. Jenner. Her effort cut short. They're battling every second here. Empty net on the other side. Ottawa needing a goal to tie things up. A must-win game. Daryl Watts. He's trying to create some space. Gilmore in front. That's kept out by Re uh, Victoria Bach, rather. Bach. She fires it.
big shot. And an empty net again. They could see another empty net goal. Venetia got... And if you're wondering why they keep pressing with that, well, of course, they've got to close this out in regulations. Gamora, now Clark in front. That one just behind. Support in the slot. It's empty. A chase. Willoughby has it now. Harmon trying to come up to it, but Samantha Kogan all alone with an empty net. She scores. The seasons, I should say, for Toronto. And they opened the season here at Mattamy. It was a 4 nothing loss to New York. And then a few losses mounting on top of one another. They've come out strong and the fans on their feet. A statement home win to close a